I've been seeing a lot of things lately about freedom of speech, mostly on X. Um, people are saying that freedom of speech has limitations. Freedom of speech um, only applies to certain speech. Where my belief is freedom of speech is absolute. It's a God-given right. I mean, the Bill of Rights are inalienable rights. At least in my view, you can try to prove me wrong down in the comments. But freedom of speech doesn't mean you don't have the freedom to be an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> and going through some things today, I uncovered this story from, uh, it's about a week ago. Um, Macklemore, rapper from Seattle, declares F America to cheers at Seattle concert benefiting UN agency with alleged Hamas ties. Now, I don't care about the UN agency crap. I don't care about the Hamas ties. What I'm more worried about is the fact that you had somebody get up on stage, who, by the way, is an American citizen, and he has the right to do this. He has the right to say this. In fact, I'm going to play the video for you guys. And this is all going to tie back to something else I came across today, so just bear with me. So here is Macklemore, who just got on stage at an event in the Seattle area, and you can take a listen. Straight up, say it. I'm not gonna stop you. I'm not gonna stop you. Um, yeah, fuck America. Now, what really bothers me about this, even more so than just him saying, fuck America, is the cheers for it. Now, there's been some there's there's been some repercussions for this for Mr. Macklemore. Um, he's been dropped from a music festival in Vegas after that comment. The Neon City Festival, Macklemore was announced as a headliner on September 19th. Well, now a few days later, he's been dropped from the festival. You reap what you sow, dude. Now. How this all ties back to something that I just came across today. That would be country artist Hardy. If you haven't checked him out, check him out. He, he's, he's got some pretty good music out there. Even if you're not a country fan. His music's pretty good. So Hardy comes out. And this is where this all ties back together. And this article is from Outkick, David Hookstead. Country music star Hardy has no tolerance for people who hate the USA. Fresh off of having to deal with the idiotic rapper Macklemore telling people to F America. And it was a disappointing reminder of how stupid some people can be. Yeah. Completely effing stupid. The United States is the greatest country on the planet. We'll never apologize for loving and defending it. That's exactly what Hardy made clear over the weekend. The popular country music singer is performing at Nyland Stadium, University of Tennessee, over the weekend when he shared a very simple message for those in his audience. I'm going to see if I can pull this up here. Oh, here's a video clip. Here with all the crazy shit going on, I see a lot of people posting and talking shit about living in the United States of America and being a United States citizen. And to that I say, fuck you. If you don't want to live here, fucking live somewhere else, motherfucker. The United States is the greatest country on this planet. Here I'm damn proud of it. 
We got people that work their fucking ass off every single day of their life. Put their life on the fucking line so we can come at concerts in the stadium. So we can drink fucking beer and hang out. And just be more than fucking people. So there you go. Um, he had the guts to say what the majority of us basically think. Now, hearing him go off like he did is, is, is what I wish more people would do in response to people like dumbass Macklemore. So here's what was floating around social media. Hardy, so good in concert and speaks the truth. Hardy is the man. I don't know who Hardy is, but now I'm a fan. At Macklemore for you, buddy. Amen. Fuck Macklemore. Yes. This is how you do it. Good old love and pride for the nation. Based AF. Awesome. Amen. Yo, Macklemore. Hardy would like a word. Hardy probably bitch slap him is what would happen. This is one of the reasons why I love Hardy music. Hardy is the anti Macklemore. I'm liking Hardy's more and more these days. Well, that's a different kind of Hardy's, but you know, his songs actually speak to me. Unlike most of today's pop country. People love the weight in the truck singer's message and people should. There's nothing to be ashamed of when it comes to being an American. Exactly. So there you go. Props to Hardy for going out on stage and saying what the majority of us in this country feel. So comment down below. Tell me what you think. Whether you agree with me or disagree with me, I... Doesn't really matter. I want to hear everybody's opinions. While you're at it, please take the time to smash that like button. Give me a little thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you're new here, thanks for hanging on and watching. If you're a returning viewer, thank you too. Appreciate all of you. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss a video. And with that, I will see you guys later.